In this video, I'm going to show you how you can mute someone on your Discord server. So what does it mean to mute someone on Discord? Basically, muting someone is not allowing that person to send text messages on any of the text channels and also not allow them to join any of the voice channels. So if they're being annoying or spamming or something, you kind of like limit the damage they can make. So for this, you need a muted role. So the long way is creating the role ourselves and then kind of like setting it up on each channel. But we have a bot that does it for us. It's called Wick. Let's just Google it. It's Wick bot. We have it right here. The website for this bot is wickbot.com. We're going to use it to get the muted role. You can keep using it yourself, but I find it a little too aggressive. So I don't use it in the long term. So let me go ahead and invite it. So now that we have the bot in our server, let's go ahead and set it up so that it creates those roles for us. Before I do so, let me show you real quick. I'm going to server settings and then roles. I don't have any roles other than just the bot, right? So now that I've shown you that, let's go ahead and set up the bot. This can change, so just keep that in mind. The command to set it up is W exclamation mark setup. It's going to run that. It's a whole process. It's so fancy. So it's you see, it's checking that there isn't a muted role and it's creating it. If there isn't, then it's adding the mute role to all the channels that I have active. Also has like a quarantine role. Quarantine role is like basically you're semi banning someone from your server. Like if you give the quarantine role, everything completely disappears and you have to remove that role from the person so that they can see the server again. Okay, so now that we have the setup finished, you can kick the bot if you want to because it created the role. I'm going to show you it's server settings, roles. It created the muted role and then that quarantine role that I'm not really gonna use, but um, the muter role is what I need. So I'm gonna leave the bot here, but if you want to, you can kick it already. The roles are not going anywhere. So to demonstrate it, I'm going to put two discords side by side so that you can see how it acts. So I'm gonna put the administrator discord on the left and then basically a user on the same server on the right. So this user is the owner of this server, right? And then on the right, we have this user that is not the owner of the server, right? You can see that it can speak. I can send a message, no problem. So now if from the owner server, I want to mute this user, I go to his profile and then I click the plus sign and then I give him the muted role. Pay attention on the right as this will go away and the ability to join to the voice channels will also go away. So if I give this user the muted role, boom. As you can see, the ability to speak in the text channels went away and the ability to join the voice channels also went away. So this user cannot do anything right now. Basically, he cannot speak on any of the channels um, because that's how the bot set up the muted role. I recommend you to have a channel where they can speak basically so that they can kind of like ask for forgiveness because if they're muted completely, they will not be able to communicate or to say sorry if they were bothering. So you can create something like apology or something like that. And um, then by default, this new channel that I created has the muted role. So I'm going to go to edit and then permissions and you can see that it has the muted role added. You just need to go where it says muted and then just send messages, click yes, so that the muted people can actually send messages on this channel. So I'm going to close. And as you can see, this person cannot still speak on any of the other channels, but in the apology one, they can say sorry, right? And then you can kind of go like, okay, well, you're unbanned. And now this person can kind of like speak and do things on the rest of the server. So that's how you can set up a muted role on your Discord server. I hope you found this video helpful. And if you did, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Have a wonderful rest of the day, my friends, and stay safe out there.